Hello everyone, Shantae here. So I have, hope you guys are having an awesome, awesome day. And it's um it's um almost one o'clock in the morning. I can't sleep, so I decided to do my video. So um this is the my submission for Scrap the World's her um uh Prima Doll Domino slash Bottle Cap Dangle charm swap and um i'm gonna show you my submissions and let's see um i use all different papers on each one that's different and so i'm finished with them all i have to do is package them up and then i think i'm gonna try to create another one so the first one is um this one and my angle is not the best uh for trying to show these but this is the first one that I created and let me see this one is for Cheryl she's um, Jim Zell here on the YT and let me just zoom on up and I did a lot of work on this particular one I must say um, y'all know I've been in the dump and I was trying to get out of the dump this was my get out of dump project. <laughs> it took me forever. But anyway, so let's see. I used uh, mesh bling to frame out the tag until the bottom where I used metal, the metal corners. Um, I also used the doll paper, the doll stamp pad, paper pad for her um, body. Um, I did a ombre effect for her dress. As well as her hair, um, it's um, ombre. I ombre her hair, which means just two colors blended together. So I look like her hair is um, dyed with a little hint of um, color. I love the way her hair turned out, and it wasn't anything special. I just did the ombre, like I said. Her dress is colored in um, gelatos. I actually did her dress in gelatos, two color of gelatos that I blended. <clears throat> and then I went over with the Winkle Stellar markers, but then I went on top of the top part of her dress with the um, gelato in the same color that has shimmer. So the top is just a little bit more shinier, as you can see, than the bottom. See, that's the bottom, that's the top. This right here came out of our Prima box we just got. You're, it says, you're cute. Um, uh, Alpha Wonder Sticker Collection. We have uh, Want to Scrap. In the corners and this is just a clusterization <laughs> a cluster of flowers all different kind paper acrylic um, there's a stick pen right here stick pen um, I glittered up I sprayed and glittered the flowers I don't know if you can really tell that's the porcelain rose the um, feather. Um, this is another metal piece that um, you really can't see, but it's a metal piece under here that layers all that. And <clears throat> this is I, this is Prima Romance novel paper, if I didn't say so. And so just to finish it off, I just made a bow, but I crinkled up my seam binding and made a bow. But it's you know um, I shouldn't have did it because once you crinkle up, it just go everywhere. But anyway, that's how the bow should look. <clears throat> This is the back, <clears throat> and um, focus. Okay, and what I did was I used a metal, uh, one of those metal pieces um, to hang the dangle on. And let me just, I used one of these little clamps. Um, I used one of these little pins to attach the um, domino to and let me just try to take this off without um and to people in my group there's an extra jump ring like on this one right here that does not belong on this this was the only way that i could come up with to attach it to the tag um so that extra one you see right there is does not go with it you just clip it off but anyway <clears throat> i use part of the paper this is actually one of those um this actually one the um Dollar Tree dominoes. I used my markers and turned it black, and then I put the paper on, and then I glossy accented it. Glossy accented the um paper, 
and um this is my uh bead situation um with a little bu uh, butterfly and all of that i'm very pleased with the way it turned out um so that's the first one oh my goodness i'm already five minutes okay let me speed up the second one i'm just trying to get this hook back on because um okay the memo i think it's a memo pen anyway i'm just trying to hook this back up so all i have to do is package these up and ship them off okay and then the second one is um this one this one <clears throat> and this right here i used uh let me try to go, go a little bit slow this is for scrap list and try to go up slow all right so this is the prima lyric collection again i used the doll a4 pad for her body um I uh, stamped her dress out in paper, but went over with Marcus to uh, color her sleeve and the little ruffle part so it would be um, different. I did the same thing with the shoes. Um, this is just a, um, what you call it, um, you know, the little pieces I used just to make it um, so you wouldn't, uh, just as an interest to a little headband or whatever. This want to scrap. <clears throat> I stamped this stamp set off a stamp from a uh, Simon Says stamp and popped it up. <clears throat> I went over her dress lined up with the Wink of Stella pins. Um, and this is just uh, our acrylic spray. And uh, these flowers are prima. You know, I got all kind of flowers. Y'all know I love to use a lot of flowers and tuck them in. This is an acrylic piece right here. And, uh, Another um, porcelain flower, I guess you could say. And these, this one right here, I was able to take the center out. This one, I couldn't take the center out, so I just stickled it up. And um, I used, uh, what spray was this? That um, Mr. Huey Clear Spray. Man, that stuff is ridiculous. It's so strong. And so it got all on the back of my tag, all on the door, just everywhere. So, um that's why the black flower don't look black it looks silver <laughs> and um this is a doily i use as the base of this one um i just glued it down at the um cross points and i wrapped it all the way around to the back so that's the back with my information and then that's it and so um the same concept with this dangle i had to um jack it up to get it on here uh, so it'll stay um, in shipping and this is the paper I use for it. another sheet out of the lyric collection I did the same concept and then this is the um, dangle again you'll see that extra little piece that don't belong that's just to hook it to the tag. And this is uh, my beads, glass beads, and come on, all of that. For that, <clears throat> so that's that one. And my last one is um, for um, D Love 104. And let me see if I can. Let me clamp this back on. And of course, it's same binding up at the top of um, this one right here. It's usable for that one. So that's the second one. Okay, so my last one, I used um, Bo Bunny, the Avenue Collection. And this is this one. And um, I did the same thing with her, the bow just... Did the same thing with the bow and her dress. This is the only dress that I um, I use my alcohol markers to give it like a blue jean color. And it's going to match. You'll see where I got the colors from in a minute. This came from the Prima paper. 
And uh, you got want to scrap bling. This is a spray, one of those butterflies we all got. <clears throat> and then uh, all these flowers and whatnot tucked in. Fabric flower. This is a trim from Hobby Lobby. And I just um, did this um, other trim I got from Scrapbook with me, and then another piece of lace trim um, that was in my stash as well. And let's see, that's it. I stickled and sprayed that to death. And let's see, um, the back is this is where I got the color scheme from. This is another sheet of the paper. This has my information on the back. And I got the, um, this is where the colors came from. It matched the, the this matched the front um, perfectly. So, um, and then let me show you this dangle. See if I can take it off without. Um, this is my first time doing a domino dangle, um, domino, anything domino. I bought them and never used them, so I was like, yeah, let me go and use some of these. This is um, the bell for this one. I used a different sheet of paper. And I did the same thing. Changed the color. These were white. And I just changed the color up, put the paper on the back. <clears throat> and this is her um, bead right here. Okay. Ooh, 11 minutes wow okay you guys so those this these are my entries and um i gotta figure out how um on oh, the extra one is right here on this one that don't belong just so you know uh so you can get it you can take it off um i just gotta see how i'm gonna package these up and put these in the mail since today is well monday um the mail is not running, so I'm going to try to put these in the mail Tuesday, but realistically Wednesday, because I'll say one day and then it'll be in a whole nother day of the week or whatever, and get these off of the mail. So again, this one is for um, the Love 104, okay, this one is um, for Scrap Bliss, and I hope the ladies like them. That's the charm on the back. Um, you know. And then this one is for Cheryl. Now, I know she loves romance novel. That's why I made sure to use this. She loves uh, romance novel paper. Because I remember them saying in a video. Um, when they was at their, um, their getaway. So, that's why I used that. So, you guys. I hope you guys like um, your um, tags and your uh, domino charm. And that's it, you guys. Um, yeah, like I said, I got to figure out how I'm going to package these up and get these babies off in the mail. And, uh, yeah, that's it, you guys. Have a blessed day, and I will be back with um, another video. Um, all right, bye-bye.